Hey, what's up? What's up out there? All right. Back at you with another video. We're going to take a look at uh, what's going on today in the stock market and also uh, with my cash app portfolio. All right. So um, as you can see and as you've seen in a lot of my videos, I uh, invest in the stock market with cash app. I also invest with uh, Weeble and Robinhood. Today, we are going to once again look at my cash out portfolio. All right. So as you can see, I, um, I'm i sitting right now at 722. Um, the market is up today or my investments are up. Um, as you can see there, 3.94% is how much I'm up today. I gained $27.42 overall today with my investments all right so uh, let's look at here overall i invested 825 uh, now where you see the gain it's an it's a negative 102 so i'm still overall i'm still down because of the bear market that we are in but today was a really good day all right so i'm holding on i'm not selling anything uh, so I haven't lost 102. I just haven't, you know, because I'm holding on. I'm continuing to dollar cost average. Um, and in time, I will uh, be in the positive uh, when the market turns around. So uh, in saying that, I am no financial expert. Uh, this video is for informational and entertainment purposes only. If you choose to invest do so after doing your own research all right so let's look at my stocks my individual stocks in cash app i have tesla i'm up today 16 dollars, and you can see here you can sort your stocks uh, by daily return your total return uh your percentage your investment value share price and market cap so let's just say if i wanted to look at the percentage it gives you your percentage return like you know like like i was saying before i'm still down overall but today um the stock market my my investments went up today so let's go back to daily return with tesla i'm up 16 dollars and 65 or 85 cents nvidia i'm up four dollars and 72 cents with apple i'm up three dollars and seven cents alphabet google i'm up two dollars and eight cents user testing i'm up 69 cents all right so that's that on my my uh investments here and then let's we uh some of the stocks i'm following carvana's up big time today eight percent gamestop is up big time now gamestop is one of those I'll, let me pull this up real quick you know th this is the this is a big old meme stock what they call a meme stock all right it, it has a lot of it has a big cult following uh there's some whales out there there, there are people i think that orchestrate big sell-offs and and large uh purchases with gamestop because it has swings very big swings in a very short period of time that's why i stay away from gamestop i mean you can you can if you time it right, you can hit a lick and do well, but you can you can also uh, see a huge dip <laughs> real quick, too. So I keep my distance from game, but I, I keep my eye on it, but I keep a distance from GameStop. Um, you know, I've been thinking about the the airline, the hospitality and airline industry simply because we're in May and that's the beginning of April and May is kind of the beginning of uh vacation season and i think they're doing pretty well right now but you know they're they're they kind of still go up and down a little bit but i think uh i don't think that's a bad idea to invest in that sector um uh, amazon is up had a good day four percent let's see uh let's see what else you might recognize exxon and Facebook, Meta, they're up 1%, 1 1.2. Let's see. All right, now. 
I haven't done this in a while. Let's look at the biggest daily movers. These are stocks that had the biggest gain today. Upstart, 23%. Forge Global, 25%. Q2 Holdings, 22%. Iris Energy. Y'all probably have never heard of these companies, but, uh, you know, I think there are reasons why these companies have major swings like this. I, I you know, I'm not an expert. I can't answer that. But uh, occasionally a company will have a 20 percent increase in one day and then it'll over the next month, it'll it'll dip. It'll go away. Then, you know, just you can't you can't predict it. I'm just saying. All these stocks here are up 18 percent. You just can't predict. You can't predict that. It's you know, uh, if that could be predicted, we would all be billionaires. <laughs> but you cannot predict that. Uh, uh, Global E Online is up seventeen percent. So what that so what that means is if okay, a stock is up seventeen percent in in a calendar day. If you invested ten grand into that stock this morning. When the market opened, you would right now be sitting at one thousand one hundred and seventy six dollars. I'm sorry. Yeah. One thousand one hundred and seventy six dollars. I think I'm 17 percent. Yeah, I think I'm right on that. Um, yeah, because. No, no, wait, hold on, hold up. It would be. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. It would be eleven seventy six. Would be uh, I'm sorry, eleven seventy six. I'm sorry, eleven thousand <laughs> eleven thousand seven hundred sixty seven dollars would be where. So in other words, your gain would be one thousand seven hundred sixty seven dollars just today. That's in that that's seventeen percent of ten thousand dollars. So. Um, sorry for that screw up in the math. Uh, I had to get my bearings right on that. So, yeah, if you, you know, of course, if you had that kind of money laying around and you knew this was going to happen. Yeah. Who would not inv who would not invest and in day trade to make that type of return? You know, uh, there are people that don't make that in a month. You know, it's so, you know somebody really hit a lick on that that stock today and i'm just using that as an example i mean you know paramount check it out paramount is up 15 percent. so paramount class b i'm wondering if that's the uh the streaming service the online let's look at that uh paramount global is the rebranded recombination of cbs and viacom that has created a media conglomerate with global scale. Yeah, that's that's got to be the the streaming app. Uh, CBS and Warner Brothers or uh, Warner Media. Yeah, that that's got to be the the streaming app. They've Paramount really has started coming out and pushing uh, Netflix and um, all the other streaming services, Hulu. Uh, stars they've really come out in disney plus you know they've paramount's just come out with their own their own app and they're just like yeah we, we're gonna throw our hat in this ring and make this money too so <laughs> so anyway yeah that's those are my stats for the day i just wanted to keep y'all in tune with what you know what's going on with my cash app investments uh, not to influence you to do anything but just to share with you uh what what i'm doing you know and how it's working out all right so if y'all have any questions or uh, comments about the movements in the stock market this week please leave those below and i greatly appreciate you